So we've got a cinema that is busy filling up because people are walking inside the cinema or walking into it. They say four people enter during the first minute. Okay, so four people enter during the first minute, six people enter during the second minute, and eight people enter during the third minute. After six minutes, the theater is half full. Okay, so we know that this is one minute, this is two minutes, this is three minutes. We can clearly see an arithmetic pattern is taking place here. So we can actually just quickly fill it in. So six minutes would be here. All right, so check this out, guys. How many people are there? Well, 14 people entered, but how many people have entered in total? Well, you could go add these numbers together, or you could use the sum formula. I'm just gonna be fancy and use the sum formula. So we know that there are six terms. So we can just find the sum of those first six, which is actually six minutes. Now, A is your first term, which is four. And then the common difference is two. So we can go work that out. And as I said, you could have just added them yourself. It's probably faster, but I'm just being fancy. And that's 54. Okay, so there are 54 people who have entered during six minutes. They said that after six minutes, the theater is half full. So then it means that this cinema can hold 108 people because it's double 54. So let's say here, cinema capacity is 108. So there can be 108 people in total. So it says, how long will it take for the cinema to be full? Well, we know that we need to get 108 people in there all together. So I'll use a, I'm using this formula again, but now in, I don't know. The number of minutes, I don't know. A is still going to be 4. And then the common difference is 2. Now I take this 2 over, so it becomes 216. And then 8 plus 2n minus 2. And then I'm going to simplify these numbers here. So it'll become 8 minus 2, which is 6. I'm then going to multiply the n into the bracket. And then it's a trinomial. So I'm going to keep the 0 on the left. And then I would use the quadratic formula to solve. N would be 9, or n would be negative 12. But now you can't have a negative number as your position or as your minutes. So this one will be a no solution. And so the answer is going to be 9 minutes. That's how long it'll take to fill up this entire cinema. Some of you might be saying, but wait, if it takes six minutes to fill up halfway, why wouldn't it be 12 minutes to fill up completely? Well, guys, as you can see, the people are filling up into the cinema faster and faster. In the first minute, four people walked into the door. In the second minute, six people have gone in, or six people went in during that second minute. So now there's 10 people already. Then in the third minute, eight people walked in there. So there are more people walking in as the minutes go by.